I've been doing some research on the Corvette. Come down and hear the story. Hello and welcome everyone back to the second stream of today. Uh, this time with a little bit of Forza Horizon 5. I have been playing this game quite a bit over the last couple of weeks or so. Uh, and um, actually I'm pretty, uh, pretty, pretty, pretty far into the game. Uh, but I find it very relaxing and chill. And so... I thought why not turn on uh, the stream machine and share it with all of you, hang out a little bit, drive around in fast cars, sometimes not so fast cars, and uh, sometimes just get stuck. So uh, here we go. Hello Autumn Proposals, mysterious YouTube name, and um, 
that means we can also jump in and you can uh, wander at the beautiful car that I'm currently driving to my next race. Also let me know how the sound balance is and if there are any other issues trying out a, a few different things with the audio settings so if th something is off let me know. Beautiful car. Drives about 10 miles per hour top speed. So this Forza Horizon actually is set in Mexico, so we got some jungle, some desert, some high mountains, volcano, some swamps. So just the same as in the other for the Horizon games, just this time uh, we speak some Spanish along the way. And we get the Smactus points. Should. There we go. 1,100 Smectus points. To level up our car. There, there are so many little collectibles and thingies to do in this game. It's sometimes a little bit overwhelming, like when you drive through the landscape and there's just constantly things popping up and it's just like, ah, uh, not really sure what any of those mean, but I guess I pick them up. Like these fast travel things, you can smash them and you get like a fast travel bonus, but I haven't used fast travel once in the game, so I don't even know how that works. Am I still collecting them though? Sure am. Also rocking a fashionable hat. I think top speed with this car might be seven miles, 70 miles per hour, which feels like 7 miles per hour. But it's just fashionable to drive around in it. So I guess I'm just going for the fashion points and the smack this points. We'll change cars once we get to the race, though. Because this is not a racing car. It's not bad off-road, though, so... Do you have the streamer mode on? Which means the music selection might be a little more limited than what people might be used to from offline playthroughs, but then again I don't want to get my kneecap smashed by I don't know. Dave Grohl from the Foo Fighters. Although he might uh, I think I would be fine if he would smash my kneecaps, but you catch my
I'm not even sure if it's really a shortcut with this car to cut through the wilderness here. Because it's so slow, but... Okay. A little bit sad that I can't turn on the windshield wipers on it. Let's see if this car can drift. In this drift zone. Gain some points. Okay, a little bit of driftiness. I'm very bad at drifting. I'm bad at the game, to be fair. I'm not really good playing on the normal difficulty in most of the races. Just enjoy driving around like a lunatic and collecting weird cars that I all don't know about because I'm not a car guy. But I'm a Pokemon guy and cars are basically the Pokemon for real people. So, I'll catch an Audi or a Ferrari. Are there other cars? A Ford. I heard of a Ford. Not the president, but the car. Lincolns. Again, not the president, but the car. I don't think that will be enough to get two stars here in the drift zone, but... We tried our best with this soapbox. I wasn't even sure if we would trigger the speed trap here. <laughs> oh, there's actually one of the quote-unquote story events here that I haven't done, so I might just do that. That's right around the corner here. Let's do it! Don't sweat the dialogue, mate. We'll get that later. You just focus on your driving. Okay, Mike. We'll do. <coughs> mate, come see me after we cut. I'll get you some lozenges or something. Okay, here we go. Stay I don't know 15. what I have to do. Downhill escape stunt sequence. Action! Right, old Victor. Okay. And this is the very first shot of the movie. We're staying yeah? on the road. No okay. Intro, just straight in with the car chases. Well, you're the genius. Very good, Mike. I'm in the helicopter. I look forward to seeing what our driver can do. Okay, so I have 50 That's seconds to deal. not be on the road. The stunt direction while Victor is the uh -oh. overall director. Seems like he bought it. Maybe I can just, oops, cut down most of the hill and just drive the rest normal. Seems like I don't have to take care of any of the checkpoints, so we'll just skip them. 
<laughs> back on the streets. Lots of smackers around here. All right, I think we did it. Record time, three stars. I love it. Cut. Did he buy it? He did. We can make this work. So this one is about like being a stunt double for a famous actress or actor. I absolutely nailed it, of course. Is the sound good so far? Is the cars are the cars too loud? Like but Okay. Mike and his crew are ready for the next stunt. I snuck away to my trailer to call you. Victor thinks I'm preparing. Alright. What would I have to go on? Now I have to go back. I have to go all the way back up. I think I will switch cars. Do have something to redeem now? What a Nissan. That's a car. Um, Supposed to be something to redeem here too. Um, one second. Gotta... Something. With the stream as well. A new car. Put a car. A new car. Um. But uh you got a wheel spin. Big gambling fan. We got a Ford again, the car, not the president. Let's change cars. Like what car should I take? I don't like to try a car that I haven't really used that much. This one. I think this one, this Aston Martin I just bought. Or one. One of the two. Probably not perfect to drive up a mountain on dirt roads, but still better than a soapbox. It was obviously planned, not bad driving. Yeah, this is not a great car for off-road, turns out. Just no. Like I said, I'm not a car guy. Awesome skill chain going here. Mostly because I can't really drive straight with this car. But I could also claim that it's all intentional. We got a skill point, more XP, great. Also leveled up now. Means we have another wheel spin. Unlock the Halo theme. I haven't really changed my horn the entire game, so let's see what we have. I know motores. 
But I also know no car is complete without a novelty horn. Uh. Oh. Okay. Let's see what like the. Oh, okay. Halo theme, okay. Also we have. It I have to say it, it is kinda uh funny to imagine that on a fancy Aston Martin, but Let's see. Epic, legendary. Okay. Great horn. Oh, no problem. Welcome back. I'm just trying to figure out new, a new horn. Because I haven't really looked at these the entire time. Standard horns. Why would I, why would you want a standard horn if you can have this, for example, on a fancy Aston Martin? Really sure what I would want to take for an expensive S Martin, but let's go with this. Why not? It works. Try this drift zone for a second time. Maybe now with this definitely not off-road optimized car. Actually drift around a little bit more. A little bit more already. Not sure if it will be enough for the second star. Because we want those stars. For some reason. Uh oh. I got too far away. We'll fail! Oh. There's ba basically no points. Okay, now I'm turned around. There might be also a time component to these. Because I once failed it when. We're still on the road, but. That just took me too long. Nope. Nope. Oh, don't fit. No, nope. no. Nope. Go back. Go back. Don't fail it. I have a chance here. Almost on. Was it sec second star or was it still not enough? Nope. No, no. Right. All for nothing. Well, we still have to climb the mountain. Use our horn. Really bad at my car selection so far. Could have picked a different one. Okay, a new star here. 
the speed trap. You want to know what the star do? No clue. No idea. Another one of those collectible thingies that I don't understand, really. Some points it unlocks something. There are actually quite a few selections, and but there are still so many locked, so we might return if we unlock another funny one. Now, this little jingle has to. Oh boy. I do think the paint job on this car is pretty nice. The design I picked from one of the other players, I guess. Okay. Third racing. Let's see. But use the Subaru. 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 Uh. I mean, this one is the one that I use most for the third races. Um, this one I haven't used at all, the Audi. This one is pretty slow, but gets the job done. I haven't used the Jeep. Let's use the Jeep Gladiator Rubicon 2020. Let's see if I can win this race with this car that I never drove before. But with that, it also has an inbuilt excuse for me. Very clean racing so far, despite me not being able to use my windshield wipers. Oh boy. Turns like a tank. Well done, then. Oh, you go. Ooh. Exactly. Uh oh. That was a little ambitious. Probably could cut both of the corners there. I could. No clean race. Hate that. Nice little jump. Boop. Boop boop. Put the bonuses and the multipliers and all of the things. Skill chains, checkpoints, all the falls are lingo. I actually quite like the scar for these off road races. Doesn't drive too bad. They are merely as, yeah, like, I actually kind of enjoy hitting them over. Kind of satisfying.
We're really paying too much attention here. We have a quite substantial lead. I don't really have to... Too much of a keen race here. Just getting some Forza points and all that. Thousand miles driven. That shows... Played a bunch for the last couple of weeks, so. Oh, I might have missed that one. Nope, didn't get the warning, so I definitely did not miss that one, and that was all intentional and just perfect cutting the corner. That's some pro driving. Nice little drift. And we made it. What a success. The only issue with these races is that every time I finish one, they all lead downhill, so I have to kind of drive back up to get to the next race. A little bit annoying. Cannot afford them. Let me get this one. Why not? Got a wheel spin. Let's spin the wheel. Gambling. Oh, we got the... AMG CLK GTR Forza Edition. Mercedes Benz. That's that's exactly my dream car. Forza Edition. That that is what I dreamed about. Is a wee lad. Okay. Hey, don't drive up. This one I haven't done. Local has another bouts coming up against an outdoor this time. The Luchador really looking forward to that. car thing. Did a couple of those so far. Not super successful, but finished them. Oh, we got something to redeem. There we go. Nothing. Cadillac. Anything else? Nope. Good thing that in this game there are not a ton of pop-ups for all kinds of collectibles. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. That's good. Negative result is a positive result. There, another collectible. XP board.
Juan al Bruno Rudo da Toro Loco. Damas y caballeros, en el próximo bout, I present the worthy opponent Toro Loco. Yes, we all dress up. The bell rings, the two are in the ring. Let's beat El Rival. Technical strictly follow the road. Rudos look for a faster way. These corners will eat a clumsy luchador alive. See, the car battles, I was not familiar with in pro wrestling, but I have met. Oh, this bridge is no match for these campeones del ring! Not jumping. Not good for your car. I'm jumping. It's good for your car. Oh boy. That was. That was just mean. We'll re rewind that shit. Rewind that shit again. I supposed to do that. So we're not jumping. This is not good for your car. We were jumping. Thank you. I don't think we will get the three stars here. We're pretty far away. Behold, Not sure how to do it, honestly. Some of these are insanely tough to get three stars. Like, in this one, I can't select a different car, so you have to drive with this car and have to beat the time. But yeah, obviously I've made some mistakes and drive perfectly, but... Closing on the finish, who will be tonight's winner? Too slow. But two stars is good enough for me. El gran final, what a match, but... You think that was huge? Just wait! Great announcer. That's true. He's really into the whole car wrestling thing, I guess. Or maybe he just likes our outfit. Car Mastery Point. The next Luchas de Carreras over there. You have a new race here. Let's just do this. This is pretty close by. Calm down, Romero. What's up? El Forzudo has called you. Uh, I, I mean, sorry. Uh, has called Torolo. Another thing to redeem. A Renault. Certainly worthy of redemption. Go out! El Portsudo, the 
nemesis of El Campeon, right? Surely, <laughs> it's going to be incredible! I'll uh, tell Toro Loco about it. There's a lot of chatter in this game. Most of it I've kind of tuned out. There's a bunch of chatter. Okay, let's see. What do we pick here? Take this little buggy. Uh, just the Toyota, also an option. I just kept the Audi. I haven't, uh, haven't tried out this car, so I like trying out different ones. Getting absolutely dusted by that Volkswagen Polo. The thing that I'm a better driver than these fools. Bunch of points here. Nice little jump. See, the thing with this car is it doesn't look fast from the get go, and then it feels even slow. At least we get a free clean in here. Just like at the bandits. Oh. Should have gotten my hovercraft. What? What are you doing here? Oh yeah. Exactly, Danielle. Yeah. Please be wrong. We have three points to distribute to this, to this, I don't know, just feels rude.
But more importantly, we have two wheel spins because that that I learned in Horizon 4. That is what Horizon is all about. About gambling and wheel spins. Forget the cars. It's really about just from going from one wheel spin to another. Now we got a truck. Great. Okay, so do we have any new races here close? Those are all just kind of like speed traps and all, all of those things. I think super close it seems. This one I think I already did, yep. Nothing here. We might have a little bit of a longer travel. Let's go to the next uh, Lucha door. Ay, 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 ay. Híjole. Calm down, Romero. <laughs> What's up? El forzudo has called Vehicle you tank thing? Uh, you, you mean the one that I just like out. won on the wheel spin? El Fortsudo. The nemesis of El Campeón, right? Híjole. It's going to be incredible. I'll, uh, Let's see what else. Uh, no. What else could I? Yeah, uh, I just uh, unlocked that. Uh, actually, we can drive it. Let's try it out. Was Mercedes? I think. Yeah, there. Now these two Forza editions: the Super Racer, and then if I have to tow a car, I guess. Very fast. Though. Get out of my way. Nothing can stop me in this one. Guess it's from one of those like like truck racing things, not sure what they're called. Again, I'm not a car guy. Definitely faster than the Audi, yeah. I, I mean, it's a thing like it's specifically built for racing truck, but still kind of weird to drive because it also feels super light compared with the Audi. But it will get me pretty quickly to the goal, so. Exactly. It's actually F. Well, you wanted to see it. And we won it in our gambling portion of the game, which is the most important portion of the pull of the game. And now we have to wrap it. And show off to the world how beautiful it is. It's a drifty truck. No, all the trucks and four wheelers, like. To bring to drift competitions. This is one of them. Oh, bitch. All that implies that he wanted to find out more about this thing.
here we are. Sliding with a truck through the wilderness of Mexico. Damas y caballeros, it's time for the battle of the century. El Forzudo versus Toro Loco. No cage can hold them. Fanáticos de lucha, the match begins. Here we go. It's a no holds barred race. No holds barred race, but we have checkpoints that we have to obey. The no holds barred except for the whole setup on. What a massive battle! The lucha is on! I am a uh, total local, yeah. I actually don't remember quite how that came about, but the arena. Yeah. I did. God. This is so bad. Oh boy. No! I will lose this one! No! as if it didn't happen. Up, oh, didn't happen. I'm not cheating, it's a game mechanic. Square. It was no holds part. He literally said no holds part. So I, I feel like a little bit of time lording is in play. And Peter, no holds part race. This match could not be more thrilling, but it is. Toro Loco must choose. Will it be El Forzudo or? El Campeón! Fair and square. El Campeón is waiting for Toro Loco at the west entrance to the stadium! Start.
just cleaning up the environment. Toro Loco will take on El Forzudo and defend the master, El Campeón! We go again, fair and square wins incoming. It's begun! They've broken out of the cage! Ha! Ivan! How are we supposed to raise a campeon on this one? The tunnel. Yes, I did. No jump. Eso sí es mucha drifting, Toro Loco. This is a long race. Undrif Fantastico by Toro Loco. Undrif Fantastico. Here we go! Full speed ahead! Oh, they take to the freeway! Or an odd. The cars! Oh, they are flying! Flying! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh boy! Oh ho! Nice drift! Are halfway through the route. Only halfway? That feels excessive. I guess this is the faster part, though. Was he catching up to me? Didn't make many mistakes. Barely made that checkpoint. Okay. 
almost hear the giant wheels of the monster ghost. What? Monster ghost? What are you told me about monster ghosts? I won't be able to get the three stars here either. Like for the three stars, you really have to drive a perfect race. I guess so. I guess there's a monster ghost. Toro Loco and El Campeón are the pride and true embodiment of the technical tradition and deserve all the glory and honor. Yes, so? No clue. I guess we find out. Jole, I thought we'd seen it all. What's up? No. It's El Monstro Fantasma! The monster ghost has returned! El what now? I'll send you a link. This is a classic storyline. Uh, look, just come to Guanajuato. Pronto. Okay, so monster ghost thing is a thing. Guess we'll find out about monster ghost. sure why you wanted me to drive this specific car really not handy in these streets return of the monster ghost After an epic defeat by El Campeon and El Forzudo, they cannot face their ancient enemy alone. They need an ally. An ally. And that ally has stepped Try to beat the monster ghost. Ow! From the depths of the underworld. It is You're kidding me? The fearsome monster ghost. The monster ghost plotted his revenge against his old rivals, El Carpeon and El Mozudo. One luchador alone cannot stand against the monster ghost. Here comes El Carpeon to help the Van Cora Loco. A shotgun is sneaking up on you. I'd love to know when people decided, hey, you know what we really need for our racing game? Monster Ghost. I'd love to be part of that pitch meeting. see anything I feel like if I fight monster ghosts I can also rewind in time because we're doing like an Avengers thing here oh. 
so dark. Can't, can't we turn on our headlights, maybe? That'd be Shark nice. Coming up. Will every fighter make it? Early. Oh, come on. I can't, didn't even see that. Oh, for some reason. This run is bad, anyways. Who cares? As long as I'm not getting eaten by Monster Ghost. Monster Ghost! Has defeated the Monster Ghost! When luchadores work together, they can drive away a terror like the Monster Ghost. I cannot wait to see it, what Couldn't they have come up with a little bit of a more creative name than Monster Ghost? Or did they decide that like an hour before a release? Oh, we still need a name for for the luchador evil entity. What do you have, guys? Ah, how about how about monster? Nah, no, that's too easy. What about a ghost? Nah. What about monster ghost? Ooh, yeah. Let's take that. Okay, now we have a normal race. No ghosts, I think. Uh, so what car do we take? Uh, let's, let's use this one. Lots of advertisements on the car, maybe that gives us some extra money if, I don't know, Toyo Tires wants to sponsor the stream. Feel free to contact me. I'm sure your tires are great. Tiring stuff. As I always say, you only want to go YOLO with Toyo. We are up ahead after the first round, that is great. I'm 
Let's see if we can have an even better performance. The second round. Fresh after the win over Monster Girls. You like the tracks into the city? Visually, they're really cool. Um, I always struggle with them playing them because they're much, much greater chance to really get stuck at anything. Because like when you're out in, in the dirt, most trees at least you can just knock over and stuff like that. Whereas in the city, you need to just get stuck on an edge. They look pretty. It's a nice change of pace. And you have another racing game. Which one? Could be F1. I mean, they have the famous Monaco um, track city. Could be F1. I haven't played an F1 game in, I want to say, 15 years or so. I think I had one on PlayStation 2. Am I allowed to say PlayStation if I play on the Xbox? I hope so. some uh, F1 games on Game Pass as well. Maybe I'll check one of those out, kind of see how they are after after all these years. One thing that I always found frustrating with the F1 games is that you actually had to drive well, meaning, <laughs> meaning that you couldn't just like crash into your opponents because then you either would get disqualified or your car would break and then you were basically out of the race. So you really had to be an actual good driver, which I guess there's an appeal to it. Just <laughs> always, I just always struggle with that. I'm very old, old and crusty. And another victory. Frosty boy. Hit me. El Frosto Monster Ghost. Okay, we have a few here. Tunnel run rookie. Like stale breath. Yes. Who's this? <laughs> Why are there three now? Guess that's a special thing. So.
Like most of the time of this game, I have no clue what's going on. We got a shitty car. We only picked this one, so I already feel slighted. Oh, boy! Why was there another car? I don't mean when you were a competitor card, but it was it was just like and Stacy on the street doing midnight groceries or whatever. Not catching up to these fools at all. At all, at all, at all I have the same ah. Cars, um, I think it's under control. It's on the striking distance here. Up! Oh. Took that one out with me. But now I'm behind the top three. Gotta find a way to catch up. For the second half of this course. Well, Stacy is still driving around like a maniac looking for the last target to have opened. Because she forgot some some eggs, some cheese, and, and completely missed breaking here. Trying to pick up the pace. A crumbly, moldy bread bowl. See, now I did the rewind, then did the exact same that I did before. Which just proves that this rewind isn't really any uh, advantage for me. I don't think this will end well. I'm not good at city tracks. Just too, too many sharp turns. Have to drive too precise. I really don't like. I usually don't rewind this much. But I feel like if I want to have a chance at this whole three race thing, oh, gotta gotta at least finish in the top four, not be even worse. Come on! I don't know how they do it. I just suck at it. Should accept it. Now Stacy is losing her pot of plans here in the city. Like, she's a bigger mess than I am. If they're not bothered by these passengers at all, while well, they're just driving to my lanes. Boy, I hope these other two will be better for me, because I think this car sucks at drifting. That is well. I mean, I also suck at drifting, so that is a deadly combo. Twelve points, fourth place. Great, great stuff. Not even the top three. Very disappointing. I blame the car, obviously. Can you suit this car up at all? I don't think so, no.
So where's the next one? This one. Crossier than I am. No, unfortunately not, because this is the streamer mode. Um, mentioned earlier, I don't want to get my kneecaps broken by Dave Grohl. Uh, so, this is the only one available. How do they all have the same car, but are like twice as fast as me? It feels kind of bullshit. Like, what is this? This is just... How do they know that there's a car? Oh, come on. This is bullshit. We have all the same car, but when I think at the start of the the race, everyone starts faster than me, so I'm way always last place. And then I'm unable to catch up because we have all the same car, so I'm not faster than me. Feels unfair. Okay. He's on the top three right now. That's good news. Just crashing into them. If I can't beat them, I can kill them. Oh, and all of a sudden he has like the turbo. Do that. They're supposed to have the same car.
Redemption. And I'm first place, crushing it. It's the third one. I think this one, right? Or is it? I think so. I did that one. It's the third tunnel run. See, that is another thing that I don't like about the game, is that the... map is just so... crowded. Uh, is it this one? I don't know, maybe. Ask Haley to tell everyone you are unapproved by the festival for your reputation. No? Fine, I won't. It was somewhere here. That region. Fuck the city. Just completely tearing it apart. No, I don't want to quit the current. So this was not the one. So where is it? Good thing they make it very easy to... Oh, there. All the way down there. Okay. Got it. Pacing through the wall. Oh boy! Ah, oh, and I lost all the combat. Great. Yep, just making my own routes. Yes, fuck that chat. Sorry for your chickens, bro. So pretty easy, if I win this one, I win the championship. If I don't win this one, I probably won't win the championship. Oh, I didn't look at the street. 
that is the only car for this uh, that I can use. This specific race is just with this car. Oh, I missed the checkpoint. I think, at least. Maybe I'm wrong. Could be that you saw something that I didn't see. I couldn't have been slower around that point. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> this is not the no holds bar race, buddy. In these races, it almost feels like they're just driving against me, not for themselves. Still in the race. We have fifty percent of the track. I wanted to take them out again. Didn't work out. Now you see why I struggle with the F1 games. <laughs> That seemed to have been pretty good. In some ground. I'm close to the end though. The one more big turn after this. Probably a big straight. I wanted to take him out! I wanted to take him out! Okay, I won't win this one. Not sure if he's the one in second place. If he isn't, I might have a chance. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. I mean, th this entire game is all over the place in terms of uh, the language, as Monster Ghost showed you. Well, I won the, the championship, only winning one race. We got a super wheel spin. More gambling. That is what we're here for.
can I get some hype in the chat for the wheel spins? A lot of arm mastery points though, so and those. Need one more for another wheel spin. We have two normal ones and then super wheel spin. Go with an Nissan. That that's the hype. Okay, guitar riff. That is probably the worst outcome we could have gotten out of this spin, but got the Nisa. So what do we do next? What's kind of clubs? There's one. Oh, I guess I did that one before, but did win it. That's rare. Oh, the elbow bump. Yep. Super elbow bump. That's not what I want. Yeah, I can only turn the radio off or let keep this station. The hopefully Dave Grohl one. Break my kneecap station. I just hope that there's no tree. There's a tree! Okay, let's see. Uh, don't think I've given this one. So let's do this. Just got wrecked. I just got wrecked. Right. Uh oh, let's control my car. Now the old timer comes around.
I'm a sock. It's being very protective of my man. And I did see that coming, I have to say. I for some reason just didn't react. Probably because I'm pretty tired and at this point I'm pretty hungry. Ended up on the green there and then Yep. Redirects me. Better. are always like even in the not so difficult turns wipes out quite easily the big fan the end there again. I think I was on the brakes for like an eon. Still was too fast. Crushed it. Welcome back. Just won another race, casually. Oh, I have used this car. Forgot about it. Okay. So, what? There's one.
don't think I will go for it too much longer. I'm pretty hungry. Make some food. I think a couple of races or so. this card. I just unlocked this one. So let's use this one. New car hype or new car elbow bum. that we all have the same car. Not even a different paint job. Turning corners. Barely touched that flag. It a little bit. Not really making any progress though. That kind of drives like a tank. So, I'm a big fan. think so not that i know of i mean there are better cars you can just drive more souped up cars i mean in fairness it might just be that i don't know how to do it. Completely missed that one. Needed that sign. The great yeeting 2021. Yeetening. <laughs> Played this game for two weeks, level 90, didn't know that.
And I missed that checkpoint. Gotta go back. As you can see, I don't have to soup up my cars. I'm just crushing it. Yep. <laughs> Pretty much. Spinning the Audi. Guess I gotta figure out how to do it. <laughs> Let me see. First, it's this thing. Now, okay. change car. Which Audi do you want me to pick? And which one do we soup up? The one that sucks at drifting. Guess that was this one. Okay. Uh, so. Change car. How to tune car? Welcome to see. I haven't used it. This is the room. Welcome to car tuning. You can improve your car's performance by adjusting its tire pressure, gear rate. See, that's probably where I lost where it, uh, uh, lost me. It's like I don't know what these things do. I'm not a car guy. Like if I do this, does it change anything? Zero to sixty. Now one forty two. So it takes longer there. In the garage, okay. Why not? Let's check out the garage. Hmm. 
do have a barn find we can collect. In 1954, Chevrolet entered their first international race, the Carrera Panamericana, with a new sports car. But this one threw a con rod through the engine block and died on the first stage. They've gotten much better at racing since then, lo juro. But now, it's all yours. Okay, so up upgrades and tuning. Well, you okay. upgrade your ride? You've come to the right place. Let me show you around. See, I didn't know that there was a <laughs> Let's you choose exactly how you want to modify your car. For example, if you want to focus on grip, try new tires. If you want to okay. Parts for your engine? Right here. Intake? Yes! Could improve this, it's like worse handling. There's just so much stuff. Fuel system, what do we have here? Stock fuel, race fuel. Race fuel it up, why not? Race ignition, want a racer. Exhaust. I'm exhausted. There we go. Soup it up. I'll be careful though, since it can go into another class and then it's bad again in comparison. So, but it. No, now I want to do it. And rough the engine. That's what I can do. If you want to change your aerodynamics, it's all here. Okay. I haven't unlocked that one, apparently. I haven't unlocked that one, apparently. If you want to change out your entire engine, we do that here. Oh, we can just have like an insane engine. It seems unfair. <laughs> Adjust your handling here. Jesus. Tires? Oh, we have tires, my friend. Really? Install setup. So Why not? Working, yeah. Or shall we get these Buy installed? It make it better. Make it the best car that ever lived. Since cars. Now I gotta find a car, uh, an actual race where I can use it. I think the race is all pretty far away. Those are like larger campaign ones, but I don't think I'm feeling up for that one right now. I think cross country is can do that with this one, so let's try that. Look at how fast it is now. Headshot. So upgraded. Think so so far. I think like the real test will be in the race.
But then again, I also really have no clue what I just upgraded, if I'm totally honest, so... I just upgraded it to be better. It's overall better, but I'm not sure if it's better in hand. It's definitely fast. That, that much I can confirm. Let's see. Is it's not recommended for this one, so do we have a different time that is close by? Maybe this one. I just have to find the perfect race for this one and then do the rest. Then I can eat something. we start this I do want to check another three open that a wheel spins to the trail not recommended we'll try it what could go wrong right Semi fast. Let's see with everything else. Oh boy, I completely underestimated that. You know what? That's fine. We're now speedy. Fast. Let me handle this better as well. What? What? What the 
did I get stuck at there? Could rewind, but I want to do that. Yeah, just, uh, I think so too. It's just fine for the track. I feel like we got it recommended before for a similar track where it was like a mix of Street Race and um, Dirt. So maybe it's just that the recommended cars always just a certain number, so the other cars are just not shown as recommended. With the, the track, could be the case. turn but still worked out somehow big enough of a lead we did it we won a car for the audience no, we want to race with the audience. Maybe we run a car, depending if we maybe we get a wheel spinny, then we may win a car too. Right elbows. Do get a wheel spin. Well, let's see. Run a car. On the thousand bucks, on which we can buy a car. There's another Corvette. Oh, that's the the barn farm. Yeah. Well, I think this will be it for me today. I need to get some food real quick. Otherwise, I will starve, and I don't want that. So, uh, thank you for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed Forza, and maybe until next time, have a great time. Bye-bye.